Today we celebrate an obligatory memorial of Saint Cecilia, virgin martyr and the patron saint of music. Today's homely title is Music is the praise of God, said by Saint Cecilia. Dear brothers and sisters in Jesus Christ, on this day we gather to celebrate the life of Saint Cecilia, a woman of unwavering faith and a patron saint of music. Her story is one of devotion, resilience and the transformative power of music in the service of God. The first reading from the book of Maccabees tells the story of seven brothers who were martyred for their faith. The brothers were arrested and tortured for refusing to bow down to the pagan king Antiochus Epiphanes. They were then killed by one but they remained faithful to God until the end. The story of the seven brothers is a reminder that we must always be willing to stand up for our faith even when it is difficult. It is also a reminder that God is always with us and that He will never abandon us. The Gospel reading tells the story of Jesus' encounter with Jacques, a wealthy tax collector who was despised by the people. Jesus went to Jacques' house for dinner and this act of kindness transformed Jacques' life. He repented of his sins and gave half of his possessions to the poor. The story of Jacques teaches us that God loves us all, no matter who we are or what we have done. It also teaches us that we can always change our lives for the better if we are willing to open our hearts to God. Let us have a glance over the inspiring story of Saint Cecilia. She was born into a noble Roman family. Cecilia was raised in the Christian faith. From an early age, she displayed a deep love for music, using her talent to glorify God and to uplift the spirits of those around her. Even as she prepared for marriage, to a pagan nobleman named Valerian, Cecilia remained steadfast in her commitment to her faith. On their wedding night, Cecilia revealed her vow of consecration to God, seeking Valerian's understanding and respect. Touched by her sincerity and the power of her faith, Valerian converted to Christianity. Becoming a protector of the persecuted Christians alongside Cecilia. Their unwavering faith did not go unnoticed. Under the reign of Emperor Diocletian, Cecilia and Valerian were arrested and put to the test. Cecilia, facing imminent execution, is said to have continued to sing hymns of praise to God, her voice filling the prison with a divine melody. Even in the face of the death, Cecilia remained steadfast in her faith, and music a testament to her unwavering love for God. Her story serves as a powerful reminder that true devotion shines brightest in the face of adversity. There are some important aspects in which we need to reflect upon today's theme. First one, Music as a divine gift Music, like all creativity, is a gift from God, a means of expressing our deepest emotions and connecting with the divine. Saint Cecilia's life exemplifies the power of music to elevate our spirits and bring us closer to God. Psalm 156 says the same thing. Just as Cecilia's music touched the hearts of many, we too can use our talents to glorify God and inspire others. Second point, music as a form of worship. Music has the unique ability to transcend words, reaching the depths of our hearts and minds in a way that language cannot. Saint Cecilia's devotion to music transformed it into an act of worship. 
a way of praising God's creation. Please reflect on 1st Corinthians 14:15. Here, Cecilia's life exemplifies the power of music to praise God. Her music was not just a source of entertainment, but a means of expressing her deepest love and devotion to God. Just as Cecilia used her musical talent to glorify God, we too can use our gifts and talents to praise God and serve others. Third point, music as a tool for evangelization. Which means music has the power to touch hearts and minds, making it a powerful tool for sharing the gospel. Saint Cecilia's example reminds us that music can be used to spread the message of God's love and compassion. Reflect upon Colossians 3:16. Here we too are called to be witnesses of our faith, sharing our love for God with others through our words and actions. Fourth point is music as a source of comfort and inspiration, which means music has the ability to soothe the soul. providing solace in times of distress and inspiring us in moments of joy saint cecilia's music served as a beacon of hope for the persecuted christians a reminder that god's love is always present reflect upon psalm 23:4 here her unwavering faith is a reminder that no matter what challenges we face in life we can find strength and hope in our faith when we use music to express our deepest emotions and connect with others we create a shared experience that can bring joy comfort and hope fifth point is music as a gift to share with others our musical talents like all our gifts are meant to be shared with others saint cecilia's willingness to use her music to glorify god is a reminder that our talents are meant to bless and uplift those around us reflect upon matthew 25:21 there are some of saint saints saint teresa of avila said the only way to find god is to become like him saint ignatius of loyola said be kind to everyone for everyone is fighting a hard battle saint mother teresa of calcutta said love all serve all saint cecilia said music is the purest of earthly pleasures saint cecilia still said let your music be a prayer she also said i carry my lord in my heart and she said at the end The music of heaven is the sound of love. At the end, dear brothers and sisters, Saint Cecilia's life stands as a testament to the power of faith, the transformative beauty of music, and the unwavering devotion that arises from a love for God. Her example reminds us that our talents, like our faith, are meant to be shared, used to uplift and inspire those around us let us strive to follow her lead using our voices and our talents to glorify god and make the world a more beautiful place let us pray o saint cecilia patron saint of music we pray for your intercession that we may use our talents and gifts to glorify god and serve others Help us to find joy in music and to use it to spread the gospel message. May your unwavering faith and devotion be an inspiration to all of us. Amen.